Hey everybody, this is Brandon here and in today's video I'm going to do another viewer's question and today's question is how do you make changes or additions to in one viewport that do not show up in another? Um, so basically I've got this drawing here as an example and it's the same drawing. You can see if I uh, select something in it it's, it shows up selected in the other one. It's two viewports which I'll link at the end on how to insert or make two viewports in your drawing. But how do I show something in one that doesn't show up in the other, or how do I add things to one that doesn't show up in another? So you can't really make complete changes that easily. Like you can't lock how this view looks because it's just a window into your model space. Um, but you can make it so that some line work or layers, I guess, will show up in one and not in another. And I'm going to show you how to do that today. So first up, I'm going to turn off, you can see these black lines here, these, this group here. I'm going to turn those off in this drawing because they don't look right. They are property lines. So I'm going to show them in this view, but I'm not going to show them in this view. So to do that, you're going to activate the layout that you want to turn them off in. So I want to turn them off in this one. So I don't want them to show up. So you can do this, so say if you have edits that you have to do to a drawing, like a bunch of them, make a layer that you call something, something, and then off or viewport one or whatever. Call it something so you know, and then select that layer. So I'm just going to pick this, and you can see it's in the property lines layer. So if you hit the drop down for your property lines layer under home tab, you can see this box here and it asks you if you want to freeze or thaw in the current viewport. So by clicking this, it's going to turn off everything on that layer in this viewport only. So we're going to select it. And you can see that those black lines are not shown here. But I didn't delete them. They're still on in this viewport. So by doing this, you can have the same drawing showing completely different things. You just have to turn off the layer in one and turn it on in the other. So say I wanted to turn this text off in this one, but I want it to show up in this one. Same thing. I'm going to select it, hit the drop down, and freeze or thaw in the current viewport. Now, I'm not going to do that right now because I'm going to show you how else you can do that. By opening up the uh, layer manager, you can turn this on or off in this as well. So we're going to find the the layer that we were just working on, which was text, uh, that one right there. And you can see on over here, you've got the viewport freeze as well. So as long as your viewport is selected, which you can see it's dark up here, then go to your layer manager and select viewport freeze. And you can see the text is gone. If we go down here, you can see in text, this box is highlighted. I like using this one because it's quicker, but if you've got multi-screens like I do right now, you can have your uh, layer manager in the other screen, which you can't see because I don't have my recording software set up for that, but it is there. So there you have it. That would be how you can create two different drawings, but using the same base, just using viewport freezes and thaws. So next time you want to show something in one viewport and not the other, don't forget to use the viewport thaw option. If you have any questions or if you'd like your question answered in another AutoCAD Q&A, just post in the comment below. And I'd appreciate it if you like the video and subscribe to my channel to keep up to date with all my new videos. Cheers, and thanks for watching. Hey everybody, this is Brandon from Better At Everything. In this video, I'm going to quickly go over how you can add multiple viewports to a new layout. Uh, I'm going to show you the quick and easy.